Poway, I'm Brooke. And I'm Lauren. And welcome to this Friday's T-Cube newscast. First off, we have Chase with highlights from last Wednesday's boys lacrosse game. What's up, Poway? It's Chase with your Athletics for the weekend. Today we have Swim and Dive versus RBV. Saturday we have boys baseball in the Hilltop Tournament at Hilltop and a girls lacrosse game on Saturday. Now here are some highlights from boys lacrosse on Wednesday. Good job to our boys across team. They won that game 18 to 6. Now back to you in the studio. Thanks, Chase. Now here's Catherine with today's club spotlight on Best Buddies. Hey, Pally. For our club spotlight today, we have Bree Bottle from Best Buddies, which meets on Wednesdays in D6. Hi, I'm Bree, and I'm the president of Best Buddies, and I just wanted to tell you a little bit about the Spread the Word to End the Word campaign. It's all about ending the word um, retarded because it hurts people with disabilities. Um, I have Johnny here to tell you a little bit about how that makes him feel. Thanks. Hi, my name is Johnny. I don't like the, the R word because I feel, I, feel, I feel bad. Thanks, Bree. Also, this year's Club Carnival is on Tuesday and Wednesday, April 12th and 13th. And that's the week after spring break. Thanks, now back to you in the studio. Thanks, Catherine. Next, we have Brea with information on the upcoming activities. Hey, Paula, it's Brea. Today, we have the CSUF Invitational Festival and the Chapman University Invitational Choral Festival. On March 21st, we have the CMEA Choral Festival. Now, back to you in the studio. Thanks, Brea. Now, to Brooke in Principal Fisher's office. Good morning, Poway, and welcome to another segment of Coffee Talk with Principal Fisher. So, Mr. Fisher, is there anything new about Poway High that you'd like to share with us? Um, you know, recently at our high school principals meeting, there was a decision made by all the principals to bring the drug dogs back on campuses. All six principals felt that way. Um, I am hesitant to sit before all the kids in school here and lecture them about drugs and alcohol because I know kids don't want to hear that from adults and they especially don't want to hear it from me probably. But uh, it is an important issue as far as I'm concerned and I just kind of want to weigh in and offer my opinion. I do care about the kids here. So what does our school have to offer for students that have a problem with drugs? You know, one of the, one of the programs here that is, that is really good uh, is our student services program. And for those of you who know Miss Barker Ball and what she has to offer, she's fantastic. Coach Bramstetter mentioned to me um, something that he saw at Temecula Valley High School, and, it, and it's a quote. And, and the quote is, um, mistakes that you make today could follow you the rest of your life. And um, I just encourage kids to make good decisions, whether it's drug and alcohol, whether it's with grades. There's so many pressures on you guys at this point in your life. Um, make those good decisions, and, and we here as adults are here to support you. Wonderful. Thank you so much. And I know that you mentioned last week that you had nine sweater vests. So what number is that one? Well, this one's actually number one on my list. It's my very favorite, and, and it sounds really, really corny to say it's because it's Poway High right there. Uh, but I, it, it's, pretty, it's pretty cool because of that. So. It's my favorite. Awesome. Once again, thank you so much, Mr. Fisher, for joining us for Coffee Talk with the Principal. Now back to you in the studio. Thanks, Brooke and Principal Fisher. Now to Zach and Alex with this weekend's weather forecast. And your random fact for today is the nation's tallest president was Abraham Lincoln at six foot four, and the nation's shortest president was James Madison at five foot four. Have a great weekend, Poway. Thank you for tuning in to today's video announcements. I'm Brooke. And I'm Lauren, and this has been Titan, Titan Topics Today. Jimmy, the